Hey guys, I'm Hiroki. Welcome to my channel and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna introduce a hotel where LGBTQ plus people can stay relaxed and comfortably. This time I'd like to introduce hotel the North Shinjuku located in Shinjuku. It's not an ideal TA member hotel, but very stylish and nice. Once going outside of the hotel, Shinjuku Central Park is right in front of you, and a short walk will take you to the Tokyo Metropolitan Government Building. This is one of the hotels that I would recommend for your stay at when you travel to Japan, but the important thing is that it's safe and comfortable for LGBTQ plus people, right? After my stay, I sent an email to the hotel like this. In brief, I would like to introduce this hotel to LGBTQ plus people and friends overseas. When a same-sex couple wants to say if the staff give them a weird look, when a same-sex couple stays, if the hotel be able to provide a service for birthday surprise, for example, selling a cake in the room in advance as a surprise, I send an email like this. Then I received this reply from the hotel. Of course, we will not refuse, so please feel safe to stay. Our staff will treat every customer equally. We are not able to prepare the cake itself, so please let us know what you would like to do. This could be taken care of if you prepare the cake in advance and leave it at the front desk. They said please tell your friends that they will be waiting for you when COVID-19 is under control. What a wonderful hotel! I found the hotel to be very nice when I actually stayed there, but this email made me like even more. Now let me show you the hotel. The entrance is unique with its brickwork. The warm colors of the lights are relaxing. When you go inside, you will find a stylish space. There is a long wooden table in the back where you can work. Their furniture is also very stylish. On the first floor of the hotel, there is a bakery where you can smell the freshly made bread. You can buy bread here and eat in your room. There is a bar lounge across the hallway where you can enjoy tea break. Very stylish. Anyway, everything in this hotel is well designed and it's a space where you can feel relaxed just by being there. There is a restaurant on the second floor. It seems good Spanish place. By the way, this is what it looks like at night. You can feel the adult atmosphere more at night. The lighting in the hotel is also nice. Let's go to the room. The wall is cured with unique design. Here we are, let's go inside. Wooden interior on the right side of the screen is super cute. They are gowns. The mini table in front of me is cute too. It is very popular with young couples because it is in a good location in Shinjuku and the rooms are stylish and looking good but at a relatively reasonable price. The atmosphere in the room was very relaxing and the bed was very comfortable. The bathroom is white color based. It's nice and clean.
Okay, so how was this video? I will continue to provide useful information for LGBTQ plus people, so please subscribe to my channel if you like it. Also, I'd appreciate it if you could give me a like. Okay, see you in the next video. Bye!